Carmen, you ended up your uh, second season with the uh, Steelheads. Look back on your second season uh, with the team. How would you describe it? I mean, it was just a great year. Um, it went by pretty quick, uh, but you know, the group of guys and the organization as a whole just top to bottom first class. Um, it was a great year. It was a lot of fun. Uh, ended a little quicker than we wanted to, but a lot of memories with this team. How would you compare your second year to your first year with the team? Yeah, I mean, it was a little bit more stable, obviously. Um, you know, first couple of years I was kind of bouncing around from team to team, and this year was more stable, and um, that made me feel more comfortable and able to give everything I could to the organization. So uh, I think it was just, uh, you know, a good season and a step in the right direction. It definitely showed with your performance on the ice this season, your best pro season. How do you feel about your play on the ice this year? Yeah, I mean, I just get more confident. You know, the more experience I get, uh, the more games played, it's just more confidence. And uh, I thought it was a great year. Um, obviously, I was a shoot for the stars, and I, I want to be better. So, um, but like I said, it was a step in the right direction. You and uh, Landon Bow were pretty uh, good once you punched there down the stretch of the regular season. What was it like? knowing that uh, he had your back and you had his back and, and just what was it that were so good between you two? Yeah, I mean, we got along really well, obviously. Uh, he's a great kid um, and we just pushed each other in practice and, and helped each other out during the games and stuff. And um, in order to be successful in this league, you have to have good goaltending and uh, we just pushed each other and, and then it worked out. It was a theme we talked about all throughout the season. We seem to bring it up several times in post game interviews, just how close this locker room was. Uh, you know, Grammer said it, a lot of people have said it. What was it about this group of guys that was for more or less the same roster from training camp to the end of the season that made you guys so close in, in like a second family? Right, it was just, you know, we were together every single day, mostly uh, all day. Uh, we went through some funny experiences together. Um, other things where, you know, maybe we're staying in the, not the nicest hotel and other people could look bad upon it, but we always made the best out of every situation. And uh, if anyone was feeling bad, we picked each other up and just a lot of character in the locker room and you don't get that too often. What are some of the highlights of your season and looking back on it? So a couple of memories you can remember. I mean, it's just so tough. The, the things that I'll take away are the things that happened off the ice. Um, just, you know, little experiences where, you know, we were traveling and stuff. Uh, most of the stories I can't really tell on camera, but um, it's just those things that I'll take back with me. Obviously, now you head in the off season. Obviously, you want to keep a pulling shape. But what? Uh, what are some of your plans for the summer? Yeah, I mean, I don't get to see my family or uh, friends too often during the season, so that's going to be the the first thing on my list. And um, you know, take off for a couple weeks, but then um, just get right back into training. And next season will be quicker than uh, I'm sure it'll come around quick. So. All right, any final message you want to deliver to the Steelheads fans that are watching this? I mean, I just want to thank you for all the support. Uh, Boise is always a, a home away from home for me. Um, I love it here, and I love the people, so I just want to say thank you for another great year.